Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nefo29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're a little overweight. Um, I might leave some of these matches. Um, I'm going to drop that probably at the hub. Our clothing is horrible. Uh, I grabbed the potato. Um, I meant to drop this. Uh, we have that flask. We're gonna take that to the camp office. And there we go. We are on day four. And here's our skills. Everything's at one. Let's just go over here. I didn't want to leave the jerry can downstairs because it's not so easy to see. Let's drop that here. Uh, right there is fine. Uh, I left one of the mag lenses. Um, drop one of these here. Put you right there. All right, let's check the weather. Hopefully, it's nice. Wonder if I can drop any. Oh, it is nice. All right, so the plan today is to try to get the Broken Railroad. We don't have a bedroll. We'll search this helicopter. Uh, I know in Discord I said not, this, this run wouldn't be all go, go, go. But we also, in my belief, shouldn't be in this region to begin with. So, our clothing's not anywhere close to being good for this region. So we must make it back to the Broken Railroad and hopefully find a bedroll and a lantern. Those are two items that we don't have that I would like to have. Okay. Let's go. I'm going to go in and warm up. I don't want to leave when we're already down on our temperature by a third. Um, really don't want to repair this. <laughs> Hey, Copper, thanks for the alert, and have a great day. Uh, let's go. I think it's, we're close enough. Close enough. Um, let's... I'm not taking the shortcut because we goaded down to begin with. So we're going to go this way. I grabbed all of the coal. I don't know if you noticed that, but... So I rewatched the start of this run. And I didn't make a mistake in what I chose for our starting location. Um, it was on Lower Great Bear, and I chose random. And I don't, maybe I'm wrong. Um, I believe that if you pick those options, it should be random in Lower Great Bear. And Transfer Pass is in the Far Territory part. Wow, we're already freezing. This is going to suck. So, my belief is we shouldn't even be in this region. We should never have received this spawn in Transfer Pass. But I'm okay with the spawn. It just means that we're not going to be fully looting this area. 
um, most of the other regions we go to, uh, the goal is going to be to entirely loot that region before we move on. I can get some of these things. We can drop the antiseptic. And for anyone that's not in Discord, uh, this rule really doesn't have any, or sorry, this run doesn't really have any rules. Uh, in the past, we had certain rules that I had to do my best to follow. This one is pretty much rule free, although once we're fully geared, there will be some tasks, I guess, is what we'll call them. Did I update the commands? No. Just don't use them. I guess. <laughs> I didn't even think to update the commands. All right, yeah, custom settings. I have to I have to update that definitely. Ooh, we're not warming in here either. Hey, we got well fed. And this time I saw it. <laughs> I didn't see it last time. We got well fed. Yeah, I'll update that one after the stream. Because that one is basically the... What tells new people what we're doing here. I'm kind of excited about this new feat that we have. Uh, what is it called? Settled Mind? So we basically don't have to worry about getting cabin fever. Ever. And we'll learn from the books a little quicker, which is nice. I replaced the Blizzard Walker feet with that one. Um, I don't even know, honestly, how the Blizzard Walker works. There's times when you're walking into the wind, even with that, and it just, it's just bad, right? So I kind of wonder if that, that feat only actually works while you're walking into the wind during a blizzard. I haven't really read it for a long time. So I think that one's gone for now. Turns a five hour book into a four hour book and the 25 hour book down to 20. That's nice. That is nice. So we have a bunch of torches. Um, I'm hoping I have enough torches to get us all the way out of this place. Hey. Oh, that wasn't a hey. That was a hey, hey. <laughs> we don't need to do this. Oh, I got him. <laughs> oh. Damn it. There we go. My headset just did its thing. It hadn't done it for a while and I was convinced that it was just a software issue. And right when I fired that pistol, 
all the sound in the left ear disappeared. I am not happy with that at all. I really don't want to buy another headset. It's just a journal page. Uh, let's get inside. And then when we come out, we'll uh, check the vehicles. Uh, oh, lucky day. 85. I don't know what my current one is at. New headset incoming then? Yeah, probably. Reluctantly. But I'm not entirely sure. I did I did the Windows updates today and there was actually a driver update. And I'm going to say that that's what did this. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Okay, what's that hacksaw? Uh, 85 and one's 90. Uh, you can go right here. 49, I think that's okay, right? Alright. Uh, I'll leave you right here. Starting to feel numb. When in doubt, blame a Windows update. Yeah. Leave it to Bill Gates and his people to screw something up, right? But it's it's worked fine since uh what a shot. Can't believe we got up there. Alright. Uh it's worked fine since since you know. Well, I guess since it didn't. <laughs> and I don't know, man. It's just too much of a coincidence that there was a specific update for my headset. And on that day is when the sound cuts out again. Frustrating. I am going to sleep, I think, for an hour. Uh, I don't need all of these pills. Gonna drop you and I'm gonna drop the toque. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna leave stuff here. Uh, oh, that toque was better. Let's do that. I'm gonna leave you up here too. Uh, well, I guess I'm not going to sleep for an hour. Oh, wait, yeah, there's a bed. Let's go. Warm up quicker this way. Sometimes an hour feels like an eternity when you're sleeping. B19. I brought the tablets because I knew we would probably need water at some point. Let's go. Oh, Wolf 1 is down. Yeah, like you do a 10 hour sleep and then you do a, a one hour sleep. The one hour seems like it takes longer. But maybe it's just a mind trick because you're thinking, oh, okay, it's just an hour. It's going to be quick. But it takes the exact same amount of time, maybe. I don't know. Oh, it's not terribly cold. We're only one arrow down. Hopefully we can get through this entire passage without having to stop. Oh, we have a lot of wood, right? We have cedar, we have reclaimed and 
12 sticks. <laughs> 12 is a nicer number than 11. Maybe one day I'll write a book on which numbers I like over the others. This one's better than this one, but it's not really as good as this one. Long walk. We got a long walk. We have no bedroll. Uh, we can always stop in the hub and just sleep, sleep there. Oh, I'm not sure what happened to my voice there. We already searched that cave. It didn't have anything in it. In terms of a bedroll. Um... I don't know. Maybe I might just... Oh, wait. I can't sleep in the hub. There's no bed there. What about... No, there's not one down in that other little area either. We're, we're basically left with that trailer or... Broken Railroad. I think we're going all the way. Bye-bye. I do need some of these things, though. I didn't even think. I got a... I need to craft these when we're warming up next time. Hey, XM, welcome in. How are you doing? There's battery number two. This is going to be another battery run. You're good. That's good. I'm good. Alright. Let's go check this out. Must grab rose hips and mushrooms. Must, must. I don't want to craft too many of them just because I don't want to take up too much time. Um, I'm already thinking, I mean, it's extremely doubtful. Oh, beautiful. Look what we found. I think I can use this. 0.59. Oh, nice. We have a full lantern. And I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. We can drop those. I'll keep two. Actually, you know what? Oh wait. I'm such a fool. Oh, and I took the bad one. Is that the good one? Oh damn it. I'm forgetting I don't have uh, fire starting five anymore. I'll take the 248s and I will craft uh, old man's beard. Oh, we got glimmer fog now. We gotta go. 
So we have a bed here. I don't want to use this bed. We gotta go. I don't know, man. I might. It might be smarter to just turn around and go to the trailer. Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Damn it! Probably is smarter to go back to the trailer. Let's be honest. I know it. You know it. So today's word of the day is Optimath. Did I say it properly? And yes, I did miss that. <laughs> A person who begins to learn late in life. What actually is the definition of late in life, though? Like, if you die when you're like 27, does that mean like if you were learning when you were 24? Is that late in life? <laughs> Just wondering. Late in life is a different meaning for everybody, right? Some people live to their uh, hundred. Some people don't. Uh, now we're going to be cold. I don't know if I want to risk sleeping in the truck. We, we don't have a bedroll, but we can sleep in the truck. We did it last time, but we had a fire. So cold in my life. That kept us all nice and warm. We have enough wood to have an all night fire, which you know what? I think at this point, the trailer is too far. But, um, I don't remember if this cave had a, a little sleeping spot. I think my focus when I was there was just, is there an actual bedroll? I don't think it did have a sleep spot. Not like this cave back here. But yeah, I'm, I'm thinking Broken Railroad's kind of far. Like, we haven't even gotten off of this path yet. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Magically, our insomnia risk is healed. Yeah, that's too much to read. <laughs> hmm.
Well, there should be a fair amount of cattails still out here. We didn't take much. The ones we have came from the airfield. Um, I do want to get indoors though, but at the same time, I want to I want to have a look at the coal chute. And this is not the coal shoot. I should have turned left. Oh well. Goes the dough. Alright, we've thoroughly searched everything in here. How come I can't find a bed? My coach found a bearskin bedroll in here. How come I can't find one? I want one. I gotta check them all. And actually pay attention that I checked them. Alright, uh... What are we gonna do? We're gonna craft... I think we'll do some rose hips. This is where I died last. Funny, I don't even remember. You get two more, I may as well do it. You gotta watch this, so I don't want to lose well fed already. And you're 49, let's eat that one. Alright. Now we have an extra can where is it? It's a hundred percent can, nice. You can go there. Let's go check the coal chute. Forgotten the last run go. I know, and it was only two days ago, right? I think there was so much frustration in dealing with the. Uh, should go this way. In dealing with that cheat death. Raid here! Raid! 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 Yes, raid! Ooh, we got another flare. Hey, Cryonic! Thank you for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. Sure hey, Blazes. Arkazur. Welcome in, everyone. How'd your run go, Cryonic? That's a pallet. I don't want spray paint. Well, we got crackers. Let's do that. Hey, maybe cat. Eh, what the hell, right? 78%, let's take it. Ooh, let's take that too. Is there a crowbar up on the pallets? I don't see one. Or did you mean outside? Nope, I don't see one. It was a box. <laughs> oh, you just lost your run? Oh no. Well, we're on a new run. We're on day four. I'm freezing. Uh, I ended mine intentionally though. 
What happened to you? How did you lose your run? Uh, one issue we have, we don't have a bedroll. Oh, I forgot. Last time we were here, I forgot to grab the arrow. This Gimme. Is, coming handy. is that all there is, or just the one? Okay. Uh, do we need more cattails? We don't really. Uh, you know what? We may as well just... Come on. Please. Press ready. Let's go around. It's dusk, so I can't be far behind. Uh... I don't know if I want to sleep in the vehicles. But it's kind of our only option right now. Uh, unless I backtrack. And I don't really want to backtrack. So that trailer is far. Oh, what do we have for... We have 12. Tinder. Sleep in the cars and the run. I did it before. I've done it before. You just can't sleep the whole 10 hours. Build your fire, do two hours at a time. Don't uh, expect a whole lot of health recovery. Oh, you were on Misery Day 17 and got wolfed. That's too bad. Uh, I do want to check this cave again, because honestly, I don't remember if there was uh, a little bed inside there. I have to look. Most of the times when I see those, I don't really let them uh, enter my brain. Because I'm never looking for those. I'm looking for an actual bedroll. So let's just go have a quick look. Uh, let's have a sip of water. That's your normal sleep schedule, OG? Let's run again. Yeah, bad insomnia. I have cats. <laughs> so every once in a while, my cat will decide, or one of them will decide, hey, I'm going to walk across your ribs. On other occasions, one might be like, hey, I think it's time to give you a kiss. Beat it. Oh, that's just the rose hips. That's what it was that was in here. Oh, man. I really don't want to sleep in a car. I knew it was a bad deal. I knew I should have stopped when I had the chance. Five cloth and 15 sticks. Oh, I can do it. We have 19. That's something I've never really done is spent the night in a snow shelter. I should probably do it, but I don't know if I really want to do it. This early in the game. 
in the run. Uh, let's go out this way. That way it's a little easier to get back. Do the same thing and try and get the fire in the in the back of the truck. short-lived the wind is only minus six we have a whole bunch of coal did you get an ad You shouldn't. Uh, it's going to turn into a blizzard too. Uh, let's just... Actually... Do this. We will sleep in the back seat. Uh, you know what? Let's use one of these. All right, and where's Cole? Right there. I'm going to make a liter of water. We have the tablets, may as well use them, right? I got two hours. Do that. Oh, I mean, I meant to leave this inside. And I can use, I can leave that antiseptic. Actually, I'm gonna. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. I'm gonna throw you on there, and we're gonna. Ooh. I should throw that potato on there, and then, yeah, let's do that. Let's throw you on. We can sleep for an hour. Then we can eat. There we go. Well, it really doesn't do a whole lot for you, but whatever. Helps the cooking. Uh, we still have a wind block. Minus seven on the wind. Two twenty nine. Go two hours. Uh, 
have some cedar, I guess. Go three hours. Just cross your finger that the wind doesn't pick up or shift. An hour twenty three. Uh, let's do that. Gives us three hours. And that'll be pretty close. The morning. Wind is still calm. And it is technically morning. Oh, the wind's coming from that way. Let's do this. I don't know, man. That fire may not make it. Throw some coal. 126. Just go for an hour. Alright, I should have made my teas. Good thinking. in here. And we'll drop you as well. Make some more water. And we can use these. And I guess let's eat some cattails. Until there's 15 left. Uh, one more, I guess. Drink up that. Let's go. Now, I don't think I want to waste time grabbing cattails. We have 15. Yeah, we got three arrows down. Let's just keep going. Once we're in the tunnels, it'll be a little better. You 
You know, it's not necessarily a bad idea to go that way and see if that deer is over there. Let's just keep going, though. I really want a bedroll. That's what I really, really want. We have everything else we need except for a bedroll. And actually a proper weapon, but... I think I might want to go to... Wow, wow. Most jiggles. Um, I think I might want to go to Pleasant Valley and get the memento, uh, bow. I mean, it's a sure thing there, right? And I gotta remember, one of the things we're doing in this run is we're not using, uh, a main base. Uh, we're using an outposts in every region. And I'm going to try using, for my outposts, uh, a place that I've not usually used in the past. <laughs> Bird, you're hilarious. Uh... Guns and flasks will be stored at the, the camp office, but the camp office will definitely not be my outpost. It's just a nice central spot. Uh, honestly, in the last run, it sucked having to bring the run the, the guns all the way out to uh, Broken Railroad to the, the hunting lodge. And not only did that suck, but it was highly disappointing that the building called Hunting Lodge has a gun rack that only holds one gun. So, camp office it is for that stuff. Uh, I gotta make sure, did I load this? That thing ain't gonna do nothing if you smack them with it. Can we get a wind block this way? Uh, let's just run. Get inside. Now in a region like this, like with transfer pass, it's pretty hard to use something else as my base. My outpost. Uh, I'm not going to be crazy about it and start using caves. My outpost will be actually a structure. Uh, except for the one in HRV. Hmm. What am I going to use in HRV? I love my cave. A little early, but this is a good spot. Right, let's try it. Uh, 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 uh. There you go. Thanks, Mert. I gotta remember, right click and that takes the heat off. See that? Well, it's nice that we're actually gaining temperature indoors. I would love to do that, but man, I mean, look at that big, <laughs> that big blur. You can see so much better this way. I should quit messing around though. I need to get as much temperature as possible. I wish you could shut that halo thing off, like the... I don't know if there's a setting to do that or not, but... 
there's some things that games do, not necessarily this game, but a lot of games, they have little settings that I don't think a lot of people really care about. Motion blur is one of those things. I don't know how many people actually like motion blur. <laughs> you just made it. Where did I pla pass the blue flare? By the campfire? I didn't even see it. Yeah, nobody likes motion blur. And then that. Like, uh... You know, with the lantern blinding you like that, it's kind of, eh. Blame the halo, I'm missing it. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, I need another one of these, so you're all by your lonesome. I'll quickly check the rail car and jump into the cave and warm up. Oh, we got a chunk of coal. Can I squeeze through here? Probably gather some more sticks. Missed that one. We'll take all this. And... make another one of these and how's our clothing 60 let's try it oh, that one worked I'm still not gonna try the coat uh, we can break this down now through the cave or over. Small chance for bedroll down the bottom of the cave system. I'm going to go shortest route possible. Next time when we're coming out this way, we'll end up going through that cave anyway. I mean, I know I need a bedroll, and if there's a small chance of a bedroll being out there, it's kind of strange to skip it, but... Uh, there's no way out. Because we haven't deployed that rope. So we'd basically just be walking through the cave and then walking right back out through the cave and then coming back this way. There is a way out. There's a rose hip climb. Oh, is that what we drop down all the time? I've never noticed. I've never noticed because I've never done that. I've never gone in reverse that way. I thought the rope was your only way out. Well, look at that. I learned something today. I always thought when you come in there and you, you you cross that log and you jump down, I thought you were just jumping off of like a rock. I'm usually looking for the rope, uh, the wolf, not the, 
what type of terrain I'm on. Oh man. I don't want my condition too terribly low. I know once we get to Broken Railroad, we can have a good sleep, but... We got very little condition recovery when we slept last night. You know what? I'm going to listen to you guys. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to take this cave in reverse. And who knows? Who knows? Number one is because, I mean, it might be warm in there too, right? Which helps us out. There we go. Light layer shortcut. Weird going through a cave in reverse for the first time. But if there's a bedroll in here, that would be amazing. way first Is that a deer another flare oh it's not a deer it's a guy dude why ain't you a deer Looks like it's just that guy. Did I actually walk right by that piece of coal? I know sometimes I miss stuff, but I don't miss it that much. Really? I did actually miss that? Alright. Let's shut that off. Oh, I'm not actually out. <laughs> Funny. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Got some beans. I don't need a can opener. Um, let's leave you there. You know what? Let's heat up these beans. Why eat cold beans? I'm not doing that though. I'm... Oh, there it is. See if he misses this one. What? Well, what am I going to miss? I'm going to, you know what I'm going to do? is I'm probably going to walk the wrong way. Alright, let's, uh, you know what, let's just throw you on there. We have 18 coal.
Are you 14 minutes? You can go there. Is that what you're talking about? Uh, I don't see anything else. Nope. Let's get back over here. Eat that up. And I got to check where's okay. It's there. Let's do that. And we'll do that. And that's it. All right. Um, What's our water situation? 361, that's good. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drink that. And I still got two. Yes. Take a free torch. Sounds windy. I'm just gonna put that out. I don't need it. You miss beans? I might have some tonight. Uh, I'm not taking all the sticks, but I do want extras of these. I'm walking by him, I'm grabbing him. What if I get here and it's not a rose hip climb? Oh, that would be that would be funny. Oh, I got a puppy. And he spotted us. Alright. Oh, you know what? I reloaded the gun earlier. And I didn't take... I don't recall taking the casing. Hey, look at... Wow, I never knew this was a rose hip climb. Unbelievable. And maybe it's the fact that there's no actual rose hips here. I don't know. Yeah, just never paid attention to what I was jumping off of before. Because I think I usually jump down over here and then I go to the side of that. I did not know. Interesting. Alright, uh, I'll take you. I like that. We're, we're not gaining any extra temperature by holding it, so if I right-click it, we can see better. Um, 
it worth my while? I mean, if we're ever in the need for like 17 pry bars, this would be the way to go. What do you figure? One at the end here and one inside the caboose? Yeah, there can be a code or something in there. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, what if there was? We go in here and there's like a bedroll sitting there. Got the rope. We got you. Don't care about you. Um. Uh, ooh, a simple parka. Point eight. You're one point nine. One point eight thirty and three. Okay. Let's do that. Uh, I'm gonna drop that somewhere better than this. And honestly, I'm not putting the rope because I never use it. Wow, this wind has a this uh, uh, crawl speed. Or OGs getting ads. Should not be getting ads. He will be back in one second. Welcome back, OG. It is. It's ferocious. It's yet it's only minus eleven <laughs> on the wind. I'm gonna leave that. Actually. Now our pry bar is at 100. I'm going to regret doing that. One day I'm going to be like, oh man, look at my pry bar's condition. Where did I leave all those pry bars? Hey, we get two arrows up now. So long as we're blinded by this light. Yeah, I don't know. I, I I said before, and I had somebody like I. I don't know why they put. Oh, why did I do that? I don't know why they put wind as a temperature. I I I, I gave my my point on this before. Uh. But somebody on YouTube told me that, that no, it, it is indeed a thing, and no, it actually isn't. When you drive your car, and it's minus 25 out, and you're going 100 kilometers down the road, why does your car still tell you it's only minus 25? Because the speed of the wind doesn't change the actual temperature. It just changes how quickly your body loses its heat. But the media likes to push the, the, the wind chill. There was another pry bar. Where did you see another one? Not like I care. Eh, I don't need... Oh, boy. I'm taking that. Uh... Okay, let's just go. In the corner behind the shelf. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. There's too many pry bars in this area. So, yeah, I don't... When I when I look at the temperature right here, when the, the wind chill, I... My brain just tells me, okay, that's the speed... That it's moving. Uh, 
And I might be wrong in the way that they actually coded it, but... Break the pry bars down and make hooks. We're, we're a long ways from starting to fish. <laughs> I'm not fishing until I find at least one book and read it completely. Actually, I'm going to take the paint because we will be going to uh, Pleasant Valley at some point I'm grabbing the memento bow. See, I, I'm struggling like with the, the go, go, go thing. I'm struggling because early game I have, you know, there's certain things I want, right? I mean, we have the we have the revolver as as self defense, primarily, I guess. Um, I'd rather have the bow. And so I kind of don't really want to be, you know. But then again, I also don't want to go into the dam and have to search through the dam and use up all my lantern fuel fluid or fuel I guess it's called um, because I have the the silver lantern I'd rather loot the dam when I have the red lantern and I have a supply of fuel and I don't really have to worry about it So there is some method to the way I do things. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh, I didn't put that away quick enough. Uh, did I miss any there? No, I didn't. Grab these. So yeah, I, I mean, early game, I'm possibly might skip through a region or two, but. For the most part, I'm going to try and slow things down a little bit. I just got in the habit of like, oh, I want this, but it's like three regions over. And then I skip everything in those regions. No battery. I want to read what you wrote, but I don't want to read right now. <laughs> sure, you can understand why. Take that. You make fun of me for go, 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 but in your current run, you were go, 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 as you wanted to get the Sundered Pass and do that story, but you wanted all the other stories done. You went nowhere but story places and zone of contamination. Need to go back and properly search it. See? Sometimes you just get something in your head and you're just like, I have to do it this way. Oh, and I keep forgetting. I think I only have two bandages. And... They are not where I want them. Now they are. Take it. Mittens. I'm going to leave the extra clothing actually at uh, the maintenance yard. Now, one thing you might disagree with me. I'm saying that the hunting lodge was my actual outpost last time. 
You might disagree. But I've spent enough, as much as I love the hunting lodge, I've spent enough time in the last run walking all the way to the far end of this region. Hey, Pettywunk. Welcome in. Did I miss you coming in? I'm sorry. Ah, uh, wolves. I really gotta, you know what? It makes sense to hit them twice. But at the same time, that's, I mean, that's a good tactic when you got lots of bullets. It's a horrible tactic when you have a handful of bullets. I don't need to kill the wolves because I can't eat them. I just need to stop them from eating meat. So that's something I kind of... I was never... Funny enough is usually I don't do the double shot. But I've heard it enough that... I'm starting to do it, but I shouldn't be doing it. Cause I mean, I got what eight bullets. I just need to hit them at a distance where I know they're not actually coming to continue and attack me. Cause sometimes you hit them and they will still attack you, which I don't know. <laughs> Coach would be happy. Yeah, he's always the one. Two shots. Yeah, that's right. You run. You run far. Uh, come on, man. I'm trying to get in the building. Where are you even coming? Oh, I missed. Well... When you miss, you have to take a second shot. But I think when you're not in a position to, like, when your cooking skill isn't uh, allowing you to eat the animal, I think shooting them until they're dead is kind of pointless. Unless you have a ton of ammo. And now I have very little ammo. And I'm hoping I find way more animal. I just, what is that? Told him not to s head that way, but stubborn, stupid, whatever. I can't read. My mouth is like, nope. Like, I. Right. Yeah. I need to ration the bullets. Thank you. All right, come on. Give me the key. It's almost bedtime. Luckily, we have a bed in here. And... I wouldn't mind finding a box of revolver bullets. And we're warm. 
early game, you tend to just use flares to, car to scare the wolves off. Wait for better, till you're better armed before you start calling. Come on. But, but, but. <laughs> I don't like using my flares very much. In fact, I will leave some blue ones here. Nothing. Ah. So this perk, it changes the actual amount of time that the books can be read, right? That's what you were saying. So like, I won't find a 25 hour book. I'll find a 20 hour book. That's how that works, right? It's not like... Because my initial thoughts... Yeah, you read them quicker. Okay. My initial thought was that you would just get a little bit more from each of the hours that you were reading. Oh, I gotta break this down. We're gonna get a fire striker. Uh, I gotta be careful because it's at 89. I don't have the sharpening stone. I had a drink. All right. There better be something good here. So tired. I could uh, right here. Rifle ammo. And food. Would have been way cooler if it was revolver ammo and food. Imagine taking Astrid on a date and she starts that. <laughs> Where is the Jerry can? This pack is getting too heavy to carry. Oh, that one. Can't reach it. This will come in handy. Oh, three ninety six. There's a lot in there. Uh, nothing there. Yeah, the downside of it being almost full is... Well, I mean, I guess I'm not really moving it anywhere. I'm going to leave it here. <laughs> that actually spooked me for a second there. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Whetstone next to the spray can. I don't see it. Oh, Astrid. Drink. So heavy. So heavy. You know what? I can do that. <laughs> it doesn't exactly make us super light, but 
Hey, it allowed me to remove something from my backpack from the item wheel. This will come handy. Oh. Uh, well, we got a chunk of leather. Another battery. Battery number three. Perfect. Another hacksaw. this a little bit that way. I'm gonna have to leave some of this gear behind. There we go. Who knows, right? One day we might need this battery. Uh I want to go into this room and drop some weight because this is ridiculous. This is far too slow. Um, let's go right here. I'm going to put the lantern out. So, uh, all right, let's eat. I'm going to save that MRE. We're going to do that. And then what do we got here? 21 chunks of coal. That's probably going to make a big deal right there. And back up. I hope I backed up enough. Um... Uh, I don't need those mitts. Oh, you know what? Uh, drop you. That's not what I wanted. I wanted this. Alright, we're at 75. 36 out of 20. How, how disgustingly slow are we going to be moving now? I just wanted to have a look, but at, at the same time, I didn't want to light the lantern and then put it back out. Oh, we got you. More matches. Another book. Oh, dude. Thank, thank you. Best be prepared for anything. Ooh. Twenty six percent. Give me coffee. Oh, well, I'll take tea. With our condition being what it's at, I'll take tea. Let's go. You know what? I can drop you for weight. I can drop that. The mittens, I kind of want to drop them outside. Like in the other room. Oh, you know what I don't need? I don't need you. Uh, we might need you one day. Remember I put a bear a bear hide right there? And then I couldn't find it. Ooh. More food. Pack is getting kind of heavy. Right, 
Anything under? Another flare shell. What hacksaw? Oh, that one? Thank you. I didn't even see that. That. You know what? I'm going to take them and put them where the mittens go. Take that. Take that. I don't think I care about the rope. Um, uh, I will move it to a better position, kind of like the battery. I'm not gonna be able to I don't really need it, but at the same time, I don't want it way out somewhere where I'm not going to actually go and look. So I'll do that. And I'll do this. There we go. Um, you know what? Here, let's just go to bed. Wow, it's late. Uh, you have to go to the camp office, so it's not like I can just leave you. And what do we got? We got 26. 26. What did you miss? The bear glitched into the building. That was exciting. Not really. <laughs> uh, let's drink that. I'm kidding. That didn't actually happen. Let's do that. Yay, we got more condition. Uh, let's drink you. <laughs> well, the bear can actually glitch into the building. You know what? I have to, I hate to do this. I have to pick this all up because I always make my fire outside in the other room. Um, I had the bear poke his head through the wall. I need all of you guys. The rest of this stuff can stay here. This stuff all has to go out. Slow walking. There we go. There we go. Yeah, the bear right here. Right there. He stuck his head through. And no, he wasn't able to attack. I shot him. I had hit him with a headshot before. And when he poked his head through, I was like, hey, I wonder. And so I went over and I was able to grab my arrow. And then I shot him again. And I was able to harvest him from inside the building. Which was nice. Okay, you can go there. You guys can go there. And all these sticks. Uh, we need to uh, start accumulating. Alright, you guys can go here. Uh... 
I can carry much more. Let's harvest that. Yeah, so I'm, sometimes the game messes up in, uh, in ways that helps you. It was a, it was a nice little thing. Let's do that. And I'm wearing it. that. It has to come off. Alright. I think we're just gonna go inside and read. Um, what do we have? Yeah, zero, zero, zero. Weighs 0 0.10 kilograms. Now it's gone. We'll drop you. And we'll leave one of these over here. There was no sound on that when I, uh, Placed it. Okay, what else? Uh, let's just go in now. Yeah. Hey, OG. Thank you for the resub. That's five months. Wow. Thank you. Uh, people think I'm an idiot for not heating this up, but I'm just going to eat it. And let's drink up. And let's read. What are you? Your rifle and your revolver. Let's read you. Hey, Eddie. Welcome in. <laughs> That's funny. How you doing, Eddie? There we go. We got our first book read with this new perk. There we go. Rifle or revolver two. Let's go out here. Still... Nasty weather. I'll drop you. Um, I, you know what? I got nothing I'm going to do with uh, the books that are have been read. The only thing I'm going to do with those books is leave them in a location neatly, I guess. Uh, let's go back out here. I thought I was losing temperature out here, but I kind of wasn't. Uh, let's drop. Let's drop 10. I'm gonna put that like that. They don't weigh anything, but still. This is part of the, uh, docking up all of my outposts. Let's go with that. I think we can leave now. I think we can leave. Hmm. Uh. I missed. Oh, or did I miss? Or did it just have interference? That wasn't a miss. What the hell was that? Okay, let's go. We need to... 
Make it to the camp office now. Or I guess, uh... Yeah, maybe just the dam. Man, if I get jumped by that wolf again, by the locomotive area, I will not be happy. There's two areas up there. I just refer to both of them as the locomotive area <laughs> because I don't know which one's which. And they're kind of similar in that they veer off the main path. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this and hope for the best. Now, are we actually going to find a bedroll in this run? Let's go up to... Are we going to find a bedroll today? And then the next area is, it's a similar area, but it has the bag, if I'm correct. That loaded. Looks like there's one fewer bullets in it than there should be. Yeah, this is where that wolf came. Feels like plus five. That's nice. Uh, we do need to collect sticks. Can always throw a rock just in case. The... The whole rock throwing thing, I'm, I'm not sold on it. You got to be in the right spot to throw. Because you need it to go past where you want to go. And if you're not far enough, you might actually attract the wolf closer to you. Inspect the, the inspect the welcome in and thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. How are you doing? Sorry, I butchered your name. I'm good at butchering names though. Uh, you know what? We got a lot of alertness. Let's go. And let's maybe have a peek. Did we not find a bow in here before? I don't want to walk right past a potential bow spot. Oh, you play Phasmophobia? Nice. Are you any good at it? I play it, but I'm not very good. <laughs> I'm not good because I play solo. And your sanity pills basically uh, 
keep you from getting hunted all the time because you're by yourself. Ain't nobody else stealing them all. Uh, one thing I should be doing is starting to accumulate some feathers. Alright, well, no bow. Unless that's your name. Is that your name? Alright, we got time. We can do this. Look at the lungs on this person. Oh, hello. Hello, little doe. If it was morning, maybe, but I'm not taking a deer down at this time. Run! Run like the wind! You want to make sure you said hi, that was a solid nap, you don't even remember falling asleep. I did that all yesterday, I was trying to watch TV and I kept falling asleep. I'm trying to binge watch... Oh, I forgot, I have to go through this place. I'm trying to binge watch... Uh, Orange is the New Black. And I only just started Season 3. Uh, because I cancelled my Netflix and... Uh... Tomorrow, I believe, is my last day. Of Netflix. I'm trying to get them all in, but... I don't think I am. I don't think I'm gonna do it. At least right click it and move it so that it comes out of the snow. Is it any good? It's all right. I wouldn't call it spectacular. Um, I did find it funny when like they rank it as a comedy. I don't. I mean, if they think that's supposed to be funny, I don't find it funny. <laughs> I don't know. It's just an interesting show, I guess. To some extent. Most of the reason I'm getting rid of my Netflix is for this very reason. I can't find anything that's good. And I'm tired of the amount of time I spend trying to find something good that I like. And I don't know. Maybe it's me. Maybe I'm the one doing something wrong. I'm hearing a bear. That's a wolf. I heard the... I heard bear crows. I don't know if it's me doing something wrong. But one thing I've never discovered is... How to get Netflix to show me movies that are like... In English. I don't like movies that are in a different language where they overdub it. Because the people doing the overdubbing aren't actors. <laughs> They're not as good as the actual actors. So, whatever. And these days, honestly, I, I don't watch it enough. I watch, literally, I watch YouTube and I watch hockey games. That's what I watch. You like action and I like Perky Blinders? I never saw that one. I never saw that one. I did see a handful of shows on, on Netflix though that were quite good. 
the 100 was a show that I really liked. Uh, I'm trying to think of other ones. Obviously Breaking Bad. Are you watching Netflix in Canadian? Other than adding A at the end of the sentence, do you guys have your own language? <laughs> yes, we do. Not really. Well, we do have French, right? Just I'm in Western Canada, so I don't speak French. Uh, but we do actually even have a French community. I lived in the French community out here. You just finished watching De Dexter on Netflix? You know what? My buddy... Years ago kept telling me about Dexter. You gotta watch it, you gotta watch it, you gotta watch it. I tried and I didn't really get into it. And I, I it's, honestly, I couldn't even tell you why I couldn't get into it. Look at the stuff. I want the sewing primer. Oh, more bullets. Wow, what the hell happened in here? There's a lot of stuff in here. That was more than normal. Uh, I'm gonna move you. I'm leaving these. In fact... There we go. Damn it. I should have dropped them in here. But whatever. And we got one piece of scrap metal. That's fine. Oh, I gotta go check if there's... Okay, there's another one. I wasn't even thinking when I moved that piece of scrap metal earlier. I should have... picked it up and brought it here. We're not going to the tower, obviously, but... we will one day. And it would be nice to not have to bring anything. Might not have to, maybe. Oh man. I'm gonna hate myself if I'm if I have like four pieces of scrap metal. <laughs> I think I do. Hey, there's a bear. Hurry up, Astrid. Can you get through? Nope. This one. Alright, you, because I never sleep on this side, you can go there. Ah, uh, dang it. I got four. I have everything I need, except for obviously the battery. And I'm one piece of scrap metal short. Which is way at the other side. Alright. Let's see if we can summon Darth. We all of a sudden have 28 bullets. Remember when I was worried about how many bullets we had? I still stand by it. I don't know if I'm going to start double shooting the wolves. I will. If I hit them the first time, and I'm not sure that they're actually in flight mode, I will definitely hit them again. But if I hit them and I know they're in flight mode, no, I'm not gonna. Oh, are we on overtime already? Oh, wow. Oh, we should hurry. Um, 
Okay, I have 10. Every once in a while, I, you know, early game, you think you have a whole bunch of uh, tinder. You go to light a fire and like, damn it. <laughs> like what? Where did it all go? Uh, I'm going to drink a bit. Not a lot. What's the temperature? Plus two. We have a lot of sprint. I kind of want to run through this little area. Because I usually encounter a wolf here. And I actually don't want to shoot. You run out of tinder so easily and wonder where it all goes. Yeah, well, when you when you fail on a fire, it uses your tinder up. And I always forget that. I just get accustomed to... I mean, I think I've spent more time playing not needing tinder than I have needing it. So it's, it's semi a new item. <laughs> do I do challenges? It depends what type of challenges. I'm open to a lot of stuff. But... That's no guarantee that I'll do it. Oh, we we've had rules in our in our games before. I did one run where I was trying purely just to live off of rabbits. And that was actually surprisingly Man, this pack is getting kinda heavy. Difficult. Well, let's take that. But yeah, we've, we've had rules in uh, the past handful of runs. Um, one of them was uh, because I, I... Let's eat you. I had gone so long without really using the guns that we had a challenge uh, see, I, I, people call them challenges, I call them tasks. Uh, where I had to use the guns, I had to use them in the order that I found them. I had to, I was allowed to repair them until they got to 100%, and then I had to use that gun until it failed. And I could not swap it out. And then the run after that, we changed it, and... The guns, I had to use them again in the order that I found them. All I can think about is and I wasn't allowed to repair them at all. And still have to use them until they fail. And this run, we're back to having kind of no real rules. Uh, our previous run, we had a rule like... Um, is that a wolf? That is a wolf. We had a rule that if I killed an animal, I had to harvest it completely. And I'm kind of happy I don't have to do that. Which also meant that I couldn't even click on a, har on a carcass to look at how much meat was on it. If I clicked on it, I had to harvest the entire animal. Unless it was an animal, like a like a wolf, and I was just trying to get my arrow back. Sometimes you have to click on them. So I guess, to summarize all that, yes. Sometimes I do challenges. I just call them tasks, because I don't know necessarily how challenging they are, but... I think it's always good to have kind of some kind of something to do. Is the cabin to the left a good place for resources? Is it even open, open and low? Which one? 
There is a cabin out here. It's always broken. And I guess, hmm. Where, where? Where are we putting our outpost in this region? I'm going to the camp office first. Um, oh, we can't run anymore. I'm going to the camp office first just to get rid of this flask. Oh, the one where you s in the, oh yeah, the, the trapper's cabin. That is possibly going to be our outpost. Oh, be a dude. Take that dough. Take her. And then I will take you. Come on, don't give up. She's right here. He didn't bark. Damn it. He must have gave up a long time ago because I figured he would have... Not sure I can carry much more. When she ran that way, I figured... Oh, now he's going after her. Come this way. I can't run. <laughs> Oh, he's sneaking up behind. He's got her. I missed. Whatever. Um, actually... Sixteen minutes. Oh no! Well, that shouldn't go down in sixteen minutes. Eat one of those. That's why I want to get in. Uh, I guess I can't say, leave me alone, what have I done to you? <laughs> I done shot a bullet at you and stole your food. The trapper's cabin bed gives you an extra percent per hour of healing. I didn't know that. It's like the super bed. I did not know that. All right, let's get in. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. All right. Well, you I have no specific spots that any of these have to go, but For now, I'm starving. Uh, wow. I think these will end up upstairs where they usually are. Oh, hello, coffee. This stuff will Another coffee. book. We must clean up. Salt. Nice. We got a hook. We got some line. 
do that. Smart people would actually go upstairs, make a fire, get the meat cooking. And then loot. Maybe that's what we'll do. It's embedded. All right. Uh, what else? Just take the loose items, I guess. Um, uh, button again. Do that. And uh, we have six books. May as well use one, right? Come on, little fire. All right. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Fresh meat. Uh, how long was that? An hour? Well, I guess let's do that. And let's continue looting. The dream catcher over there. Got that. The owners around. That's good. Grab that. Another book. We don't have a body this time. It's a longy. <laughs> that sucker's long. 20%. Ah, 95.95 liters. Dude. We found stuff. Yeah, we just found like the longest sharpening stone. And we have a skillet. Um, we have flour. Cans. Potatoes. Bullets. All right, well, we got a bedroll. That's a big deal. It needs to be repaired. But we got one. Oh, we got a pot as well see there's the, the trade-off though right the smart thing was to get the fire and get everything cooking but had we looted first we would have found a way of cooking that meat quicker got another one of those and uh, don't mind me i'm just going in here to get rid of you and that Out of sight, out of mind. All right. You know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to take these upstairs. Because I think they look better on the railing. Uh, I can place the flashlight from my inventory wheel. But I can't place this. Which is why I grabbed it the way I did. Let's go. You know what? Because of the rabbit, you have to go that way. 
and you can just chill right there. Shut you off. 12 minutes. <laughs> hey, guess what we're gonna do? Uh, 43. Do I need water? Um, how long is that? 48? Let's do that. And then a stick. Maybe two sticks. <laughs> come with me, come with me. I have an idea, I have an idea. Play that funky music. And we'll get one of those. New buffer memory. There we go. Wish I could move the radio. Yeah, can't move it. All right, I think it's bedtime. Well. Now, if the hypothermia wouldn't kill me, we have a bedroll. I am happy. So you need to go over there, and you can just kind of go right there. 32, 34, and 39. Those can all cook. Um. Oh, you know what? I don't need to drink that tea this time. You should go get more out of that deer. I'll get I'll get that tomorrow in the morning. Uh, so I think I'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, I thank you for watching and please like and subscribe and I will see you all tomorrow.